Mike, not hearing. He's there. I try to make sure he sees me. Everybody came to the country. Yeah, and I think I told you they told us they had like 250, 260 kids on the internet. So who knows how many people were watching. <coughs> Sing with me if you would, please. He is Lord. He is Lord. He is Lord. He is risen from the dead. He is Lord. Every this, brethren, that flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God, nor does the perishable inherit the imperishable. Behold, I tell you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, but we shall be changed in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trumpet, for the trumpet will sound and the dead will be raised imperishable, and we shall be changed. For this perishable must put on the imperishable, and this mortal must put on immortality. But when this perishable will have put on the imperishable, and this mortal will have put on immortality, then will come about the same that is written, death is swallowed up in victory. O oh, death, where is your victory? O oh, death, where is your sting? The sting of death is sin, and the power of sin is the law. But thanks be to God who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my brethren, be steadfast, immovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, knowing that your toil is not vain in the Lord. A dear friend of our sister Ruth, Brother Christopher, were the Flax. And before Sister Flack was gone to be with the Lord, she made it very clear, those of you who remember Meg, uh, she was stripes, quite straightforward. She says, I don't want to be buried. I want to be planted. Mm -hmm. Planted connotes harvest, fruit. And we're here today to plant our dear sister, knowing that there will be a harvest, that there will be much fruit. I'm going to call on our brother, Philip Jong from the Assembly in Houston to close in prayer. Let's bow and pray. Father, we thank you. Today we come to worship you. 
we come to testify that Christ is all and in all. Amen. We're here to testify that Jesus Christ is sufficient. Amen. It is sufficient for our sister Ruth. You are her salvation. You are, you are her strength. You are her hope. And you are her glory. Today we also can testify you are our comfort. Amen. That you are our strength as well. We do declare today we come here to plant, not to bury. Look forward to harvest. One day the harvest will come. Amen. We will be with our sister, Amen. together with our dear Lord Jesus Christ. Th therefore, our heart is full of thanksgiving. Amen. We pray that uh, all of us will press on to uh, complete what you have called us to complete on this earth. We thank you for all the testimony you have given to us. We, we thank you for the sins that come from different places. Mm. Our heart is full of joy because the victory is ours. Mm. The victory is yours. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. For the benediction, let's just listen to Amazing Grace. to keep you from falling and present our dear sister Ruth and you faultless before him in the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise God our Savior be glory and majesty dominion and power both now and ever. Amen. Amen. This does conclude our service. I know some of y'all are probably wondering how to get back. If you leave this street here, the interstate is just right here, about half a mile. So just come out the cemetery, take a left, you'll see the interstate, and of course, you know, the rest of Beaumont, Houston, going west, so that'll be at the right. Okay? Thank you.
step back. Back up. 